Hello, this is Harpreet Mataru and today we will be animating the lights of a traffic signal in a motion study. I have already prepared the assembly as shown. It consists of the enclosure that houses red light, an amber light and a green light. For the study, we will animate the lights in a motion study. We will do it by creating different appearance settings at different points in time. Specifically, we will animate the luminous intensity of the lights to mimic its activity. Let us jump right into the motion study now. First, I'm going to turn on the green light, but before that, I have to make sure that the time bar is located at the beginning of the study, which it is in this case. Next, change the appearance by right-clicking on the part, selecting appearance. Now, under the illumination tab, set the luminous intensity to 0.3 watts per SRM squared. And click OK. Next, we switch the active light from green light to amber light. First, move the time bar to the right by the desired distance. For this study, I'm going to move it by a second. Next, create instances of the amber light and the green light by selecting their parts and adding new key. Next, set the luminous intensity of the green light to 0 watts per SRM squared. Next, Set the luminous intensity of the amber light to 0.3 watts per SRM squared. Finally, repeat the process for the amber light and the red light. The process is very similar, so I will skip them and jump right into the final study, which is shown here. Now let's run the study. Here you can see the change in appearance is gradual and it does not represent a real life scenario. To fix this, Right click on the keys and set the interpolation mode to snap. Now let us run the study again. Now you can see the change is in appearance is instant instead of gradual. I hope you learned to animate the appearance in a motion study through this video. For more information, check out our website at CAD Micro Solutions or follow us on our social media.